Hello YouTube family and friends. Welcome back to my channel. Just being me, Devonese. So happy Monday, y'all. Um, I have a mini haul, some home decor, and Christmas. And so yeah, don't know if I'm gonna add um incorporate that with the other mini hauls that I'd have made, or if I'm gonna put this on another um video, but I just want to come on and share with you and I'm gonna start off with the Christmas. So I picked up this um, mousse. I thought it was really cute because it's in the cream and gold and, and um, like beige. And um thought it was really, really cute. And um, I purchased one earlier today. And I didn't know I was going to be going back to Burlington today. But I ended up doubling back going to Burlington. And um, we went in there and bought the grandkids some clothes and stuff. And so I said, let me pick up one more of these before they're gone. I can just put them. Either under my tree or, um, well, you know, next to the tree or either in front of my fireplace. So, yeah, I got this one. $19.99. And here's the other one. I know I said my tree is going to be black. But I'm still going to have these colors in the tree. And I still may have silver in the tree also because of, you know, the silver just brings the bling. They make it more glamorous. Um, I don't really want to purchase anything to go on the tree besides the green. <clears throat> if I do end up adding the green. Because I only have like a few green bugs. I don't know if I want to go with the dark hunter green um, again or if I want to go with the brighter green. But some of my decor is hunter green. But I think it'll still blend in if I did go with the brighter green. I don't know. We'll see once I get it together. Um, I'm looking for some green poinsettias. I wish I could find like some pretty green uh, poinsettias. And I saw some on this one website. But they wanted an arm and leg for them. So I was like, no, I'm not doing that. So here's the other one. <clears throat> of course, you see you can... Move the arms and stuff around. You know how you want it or whatever. Um, so here's the other one. Right here. It's so cute, right? <clears throat> so I got those. And then um I went to I'm I'm just picking up what I can what I saw uh, the bag that's close to me. I went to Target to their little um dollar spot and I picked up these two um bells this one <clears throat> and this one and these were um five dollars a piece <clears throat> excuse me yeah I started to get three and I should have but I think I may have some bills I think I may have some bills uh, next I, did, I, did I say those was five dollars a piece? If not, they're five dollars a piece. And then I purchased this black dish right here, bowl. I got it because of the, the, the shape of it, <clears throat> the way it is made, with like the little pedestal, and then the like little ribs on here. I really like that. But when you look at the inside, <clears throat> it's almost like it's a candle holder. But I'm not going to use it as a candle holder. I'm going to use it as a bowl. So I thought this was cute. This was $12.99. So, and then I got... I don't know what's up with these mushrooms being out in the stores. They, they've they been having them in all of the stores lately. <clears throat> and... Y'all see me taking out the bag because I literally just got home. And I just want, you know, I want to put it up. So. <clears throat> okay. Let me move these out the way. Okay. <clears throat> so back to Burlington. I purchased this mushroom. It's so pretty, y'all. 
so 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 pretty it's got the mercury glass and it's gold this it came in silver also i started to get it because i've just it was just so pretty but the gold tone it's on the lighter side but i still like it it's so cute and i saw these before but i didn't pick them up because i i have some mercury glass i have some pieces of mercury um glass that's heavy and then I have some that's really, really lightweight. And um, I thought that's what this was going to be. But it's not. <clears throat> it's actually have a little weight to it. So I got this one. And this one was $9.99. And I got the smaller one also for $7.99. So I thought these was really cute and different. Really cute and different. <coughs> So these are that's it for the home decor. But um I went to Bath and Body Works. I went in there to get me some hand soap because I'm down to my last bottle, right? And I'm more than just hand soap. <clears throat> so I love coconut and I, I think I may have shared before coconut. And like peach, it goes really good, mixes, you know, well together um, with the chemistry of my body. So any body spray, lotions and stuff like that. So different stuff. I always try to get something with coconut in it if I see it. All right. That's why one of Kim Kardashian's um, perfumes, I can't think of the name of it. I had like the bottle three times, three or four times. It's the black bottle with the purple on it. <clears throat> can't remember exactly the name of it because I have three different perfumes of hers. But that one, I have the black and gold, I have the silver bottle, and then the one with the black and the purple is my favorite. When I tell you it has that coconut in there, that's why I bought it so many times. It smells so good, so good. And I ain't really into, per I'm into perfume, but not into the names and stuff like that. Like I got three different good girls, and if you ask me what I got on, I'm going to tell you good girl. <clears throat> the pink bottle. Good girl, the red bottle. Good girl, the black and blue bottle. I'm going to say something like that because I don't know. I'm not into it so much where I'll just tell you the other part of the name of the perfume. Just like Kim Kardashian. I'm going to tell you the color of her bottles. Or, uh, you know, whoever else I got. Like, I have Gucci over there. I don't know which Gucci it is. I just know it smells good. I got it as a gift years ago. But anyways, um, this is Coconut Sandalwood um, Hand Soap. <clears throat> it was on sale for um a dollar eighty eight today at Bath and Body Works. So <clears throat> this one, this one is um white oak and vanilla. Don't know how it smells, but for a dollar eighty eight. <clears throat> Those were the only two cents they had. So no, they had three cents. So I got those, um I got three of those um coconut, two of the other one. And I got one of this one right here, Glacier Mist. So it's almost like 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. <laughs> and then <clears throat> I got me some hand lotion. I had this one. I already have this one right here. Um, this one is called the, uh, uh, what is it? Ginger My Vibrant. This smells really good. <clears throat> now this one is called Clock cloud and this smells really good i smelled the sample so i got a couple of those <clears throat> and pink chiffon and then i have um two of the hibiscus paradise smells really really good also so it's just like little um, size, trial size like I can put it in my purse or in my car so that got some hand sanitizer and uh, sweater weather and then I have <clears throat> excuse me some whiskey reserve for my son um, they didn't have they didn't have I think they had one that was called ocean and I it, I really couldn't smell that one in the men so I didn't um, keep it so all right y'all yeah I think that is it. I think that's it. Let me see. <clears throat> mm. 
yeah, I think that's it. Because I showed y'all this already. I had another bag I was going to show y'all, but I would have been showing y'all that again. <laughs> All right, y'all. Hello, YouTube family and friends. Okay, y'all. I had to turn that off. Hello, YouTube family and friends. Welcome back to my channel. Just being me, Devonese. So, happy Tuesday, y'all. Today is um, Taco Tuesday. Even though I didn't have tacos, I had some pasta. Um, Yeah, so I just wanted to hop on really quick and just share a few things that I purchased today. So, <clears throat> I had my grandkids. All of my granddaughters actually I had over um, for the weekend. And so, everybody is kind of sick. Somebody knows was running. And then I had two that was coughing. And it's like, uh, yesterday I started, my throat started tingling a little bit. And it's like, oh man, I ain't been sick in so long. <laughs> Not with a cold. And so, y'all, man. So I started drinking me some Theraflu last night. I took some today. <clears throat> I don't want to get sick. So I got a concert to go to this weekend. Uh, Gladys Knight and uh, Patti LaBelle is at the casino. And so, you know, I don't want nothing to spoil my plans. So anyways, I went to the Asian store and picked up some more of my um, uh, Prince of Peace ginger tea. Y'all know I shared this with y'all quite a few times over the years. And so I got this and this big bag is like eight dollars. I think it's eight dollars. And you get like 30 sacks. So got that. And then I went to Target. I just thought that would be cute. Or your clutch. But anyways, y'all, so I picked up this graphic t-shirt right here. Picked it up in a size medium. I was gonna I was looking for this one in particular. But when I went over to the graphic tees, all I saw was, you know, all the other ones. And then I saw a Tupac like this. So I said, I get Tupac. But all they had was extra larges. That was way too big in the men's department. And just as I was getting ready to go towards the register in the ladies department, they had this one with the B.I.G. So, I, and they had my size. So I ended up getting this one. Um, it's $12.99. I always get my graphic tees from there um or walmart but if i wouldn't hadn't found this because i knew this was kind of like the style i wanted um no matter who was on it um i would have went to spencer's or either journeys and looked for it so yeah i got this very very cute so i don't really know what i'm wearing i was thinking about wearing um the one outfit that i um shared with you it was the cargo jeans with the kind of like a bustier um, denim. And so I thought about wearing that. I'm still leaning towards that because I think it'll be cute. Um, you know, once I put, you know, have my makeup on, my jewelry on, and my hair will be done and fixed and stuff. So I think it will, it will be cute. But I was trying to think if I wanted to put a shirt under it. <clears throat> just kind of wear it over it. So I was going back and forth about that. Then I thought about wearing this sequence shirt. I've, I've never worn it and these um, like leather leggings. So I thought about that. So I'm kind of undecided like what I really want to wear to the concert. Kind of undecided. Um, I don't want to be overdressed or underdressed going to see Patty and uh, Gladys. But at the same time, I want to be comfortable. Okay. So, um, yeah, I'm going to figure it out. Oh, and y'all, so I'm cutting between this. I want to get my nails done, y'all, and I got red. Now, the last nails I got was like kind of like an orangey red. I don't know the name of it or the number, but this number right here, red, is number 430 in the shellac. And I got my nails shaped different. Y'all know I always get an overlay on my own nails, so I got my nails shaped different. I got the almond shape uh, this time, and I really like it. I really, really like the shape. Yeah, I asked the lady. I said, I, I, I said, I, can I? Is it too late for me to change the shape of my nails? So yeah, charge me an extra five dollars, and I, my nails are beautiful. So I'm loving this red. I was going back and forth with the red and the um this this orange, but I didn't know if the orange was gonna be too loud, too bright for for now. You know, for the season, but. 
anyways i think i did good by selecting the red and um yeah just they just look natural i used to wear my nails like oval all the time and then um i went to the square round and i just love the square round because it's more natural and i've been wearing it for years um whether i wear my nails short or long and so yeah boom okay let's go to the next <laughs> the next thing that i purchased uh from target i told you it's a very small haul y'all so i purchased this kind of like a boucle hat <laughs> and um yeah let me show you this is it right here and i don't know if y'all remember the purse that i purchased like this last year from target i purchased a purse like this from target last year and i wore that purse everywhere i went somebody asked me about that purse and so um yeah i saw this hat this bubble hat they had it it came in black also but i said no i'm gonna get this one because sometimes you know you can have on anything and throw on your long sweater uh whatever you know and put this hat on i grabbed my purse and out the door out the door but i thought it was really cute and if this hat was i think it was 20 dollars yep 20 dollars so, of course, I couldn't try it on because it is, but I know it'll fit. So, I love hats made like this with the bill. All right. So, that's that. Ugh. Okay. And the last thing that I purchased was this little chestnut. <clears throat> it's a storage basket. And I like it because of the, the neutral colors on it. I wish I would have seen this in the, in the bargain area in Target. I wish I would have saw this. When I had my, you know, my, my living room, you know, when I did the neutral colors, because this is really, really pretty. Now it's five dollars, right? But when I got to the register, it's two dollars and sixty-five cent. Two dollars and sixty-five cent is storage. The one I seen had a op it was already open. This one, it's not open, but you know, you can tell the top comes off of it. Very, 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 very cute. Very cute. So I said it's a chestnut. I think it's like an acorn, though. I don't know. It's not saying what it is. But it could be whatever I want it to be. So it's a storage basket anyways. But I thought this was really cute y'all. So yeah. Because you know. I love the neutral colors. And the neutrals are not just the silver. The gold. The white. You know. Um, you know. Creams and stuff like that. It's these colors too. Like what I have in my living room now. The neutral colors. The browns, the beiges, and stuff like that to go with it, you know. But, yeah. All right, y'all. So, yeah, I wanted to just hop on really quick and just share that with you. And um, I'm going to um, get started on putting up my second tree. I have not shared that with you yet, but I'll be sharing soon. But I don't want to do it too soon. You know what I mean? But I do want to have videos out the way, so... I'm getting ready to put my second tree up so that I can get started on it and then go from there if I want to add anything extra or if I want to just use everything that I used over the years. You know, I always did. I had the the um, the green and red theme and then I changed it. Um, I, cha I had the green and red theme and then I changed it to the elf um, theme, like the elf's world. And then I did that for like three years. <clears throat> but I really love the green and red cause, because it's in my family area. And it's just where I can just use all the color that I want. And it's more fun and inviting for your family and for your friends. My grandkids, you know. And so I'm sticking with that same color, the color pattern, because I'm not buying a lot. I'm not doing that. I'm going to use what I have. And whether you've seen it or not. It is what it is. I'm going to use what I have. I may mix and match some stuff up. But I'm using what I have. And I will. Like I shared with y'all not too long ago. I will add some things that I um, purchased. A couple of things that I purchased. Um, to go on my trees. And some things I'm going to DIY. Um, but I'm not going to go overboard buying stuff. Because I have a lot of stuff. <clears throat> I have a lot. And I just want to just use what I have. So. But I do want to get a new topper for my tree. I do. What I will, whether I use the, the elves or not. And I probably will use the elves somewhere. If they don't be on a tree, I'm going to use them somewhere. Because I, I, love, I like those. And I, I want to use those for Christmas. And um, But I do want to get a different topper. 
I just don't know what topper I want to get yet. I'm hoping to find one that has those colors, green and red. Or it can be a hat or I, I don't really want to use a bow. I want something just fun, you know, because it's for the kids. This is the kids tree that I do. I'm, I'm doing right now. So I want it to be fun, really fun. So I think what I'm going to do is just use what I have. Like I said, go down there, put the tree up and um, use what I have. And then from there, if I want to add a few things, I did see a couple of bulbs that had polka dots. Some of them had stripes at Hobby Lobby. But I was still thinking like, okay, well, I could do DIY my own. So, sometimes I get lazy with the DIYs. Because before I started doing YouTube, I've been doing DIYs for a very long time. And before I got introduced to YouTube, I could have had all of that stuff on there. And um, I didn't. So, now I'm kind of like in my lazy time with the DIYs. But I will do some. But um, nowhere near like what I used to do. But um, okay, y'all, it's later in the day. I done took a nap and everything. Showed y'all what I ate today. And um, here's my haul. I bought some laundry soap too, but it's in my laundry room already. I bought some disinfectant wipes. And then I got a personal haul. Got some panty liners. Some shavers. Some liquid makeup, some mousse, Summer's Eve, and some vinegar and water. So that's it.